Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Anastasia. Welcome everybody. Today is Saturday and you know exactly what is happening on my channel on Saturdays. On Saturdays, I review products the company sent me. Today we are reviewing another balloon garland kit from the company I've never worked before. Company name is Bloonzy. This is the kit that I received from them. I like the colors so far. And they did send me this card. It's a beautiful card with a personal note inside. Thank you so much, Bloonzy. I'm excited to review this kit. Everything that you need to know about this kit, I'll let you know as we go, as we review and build this balloon garland. So without any further ado, let's go. This is the package that you will receive from Bloonzy when you'll purchase your kit. This kit includes four balloons, an 18 inch premium quality balloons, 66 balloons in 12 inch, 50 balloons in 5 inch, balloon tying tool, 17 inch long balloon decorating strip, clear string, and 100 glue dots. I mean, everything is listed on the bag which is nice now let's dig in and see what's inside what we will be working with today different shades of blue there's regular latex balloons then we have latex balloons but in pearl color we have white silver confetti balloons silver pearl balloons and promised goodies over here with fishing line balloon tying tool balloon strip and glue dots also we have this paper over here with instructions on how to build your balloon garland i am ready to blow all of my balloons we are working with a balloon strip that means we are blowing our balloons individually and tying all of our balloons individually i am using my balloon a tying tool to tie all of my balloons you guys don't try to tie all of your balloons with your bare fingers. I mean, you can try, but uh, I've been there. I know what it is to tie a whole bunch of balloons. And afterwards, I had huge blisters. My skin was off and it took forever to heal. So it's better to use this balloon tying tool that is included in your kit. I am using electric balloon pump from Laura Dale Paper and Balloon Company. As always, you guys, if you're interested in purchasing anything from Laura Dale Paper and Balloon Company, you can always use my code Anastasia10 for 10% off. Let's talk a little bit more about Bloonzy's balloon kit. This balloon kit you can purchase on Amazon and it will cost you $17.93. Pretty good price for 120 pieces that this kit includes in itself. I am curious to see how this whole thing will look together. So let's go. You guys, one more thing that I forgot to tell you, as soon as I'm done blowing one of the balloons, I am pressing balloons against the floor to give my balloons more rounder shape. blowing all of my latex balloons let me quickly show you what I do with my latex of balloons blow your balloon up use balloon tying tool to tie your balloon I will be showing my favorite way how to static all confettis inside of your balloon there's different ways but this is my favorite I am simply taking my hands and start rubbing all over my balloon that way you're creating static in your balloon and all of the confetti is starting to stick to the walls of balloon give it a shake rub some more 
You can also take a piece of paper towel or towel and rub with those things, but be careful. Sometimes towels and paper towels can leave these white foggy marks on your balloon and balloon will look um, scratched. So hands, they're the best. Let's construct our balloon garland. As you can see here, we have two holes, bigger hole, little opening, and smaller hole. We're starting to insert our balloon into a bigger hole. Make sure your knot is completely through, then slide your balloon through that little opening into a smaller hole and let it go. That's all you need to do to construct your balloon garland. I am inserting all of my balloons on one side of my strip. I am not twisting my strip. I don't see a difference if you twist or not. You insert your balloons, you let them go, and they will twist themselves. They will lay where they need to lay. Plus, if you'll see, your balloons are starting to pop out out of those holes. That means you need to skip a hole. I can't really give you a pattern where or when to skip the hole, but just keep an eye if you see your balloons are starting to fly out out of your strip, skip a hole. I am planning to alternate my colors because I had a question, how do you insert balloons like color-wise? I don't really have a pattern, sometimes I do if there's like three colors and I'm like, okay, red, blue, and pink, for example, red, blue, and pink, and I go by that. But then balloons are starting to twist and they mix themselves up and you don't really have to have a pattern. Just whatever you feel like you need to insert and next, go for it. In this case, in this balloon garland, I feel like I want to work with white and blues blue balloons now and then I'm going to skip my confetti balloons and silver chrome balloons because I don't see a lot of them in this kit. I will be inserting my 18 inch balloons into my base as well. One tip or here's what I do when I work with bigger balloons in my base using balloon strip. If I use bigger balloon in my strip I like to skip a hole after my bigger balloon because bigger balloon is bigger and it's taking up a little more space so I like to skip a hole to avoid my balloons popping out you know what you guys I changed my mind I will be using silver chrome balloons in my garland as well that I don't really usually do if I use a balloon strip. I will be inserting some of the five inch balloons between my bigger balloons into my base, which as I said, I don't typically do that, but today is different. I think I'm gonna insert like five balloons, five inch. wanted to mention I almost used up all of my balloon strip I don't have a lot left usually I have more left and here is why because I inserted five inch balloons into my base and I will see if I like it or not we'll see so if you want to make your balloon garland longer then insert some of your five inch balloons into your base is on my backdrop everything's ready to be filled with the remaining balloon balloons that I have laying on my floor now by this point I think you know what I'm gonna tell you how I hang my balloon garlands I will link a video of commonly asked questions 
in the description under the video so you can go check that video out i do show an up close on how i hang all of my garlands using backdrops and how i hang all of my garlands using command hooks i do also answer a lot of other questions regarding balloon garlands so please go check that video out i'm pretty sure it will be helpful and for our next step, I am taking my glue dots and starting to fill in spaces with the remaining balloons. I will be using more than one glue dot per balloon just because I am more sure that my balloons will stay with two or more glue dots instead of just one glue dot. Here is what I have for you guys today. This is my review of Bloonzy's Balloon Garland Kit. Thank you for sending me this kit. I enjoyed working with this whole thing. Quality of balloons are great. Everything works together really good. It looks together really good. I mean, no complaints there. I lost two five inch balloons. I had to leave these balloons inflated overnight and come back to it today to finish it up so i lost one five inch balloon in white color and light blue balloon popped on me while i was applying glue dots on it overall you guys not bad i am very happy with the final outcome i really like different shades of green different types of balloons in this kit like pearl chrome confetti regular latex balloons very very cute I had more than enough glue dots to attach all of my remaining balloons on my balloon base. Maybe because I inserted five inch balloons into my base, probably that's why. And you guys, I really do like it. I will link and list everything in the description under the video. So go ahead and check it out. I will share a few pictures at the end of this video as well. Quickly. <laughs> wanted to share about these stars i usually don't mess with uh, reviews whatever company send me i review and show you what that kit looks like but i had these stars left from my previous balloon garland and i added them into my bloomsies balloon garland kit look at this what a stunner it looks so so good if you're willing to spend a little bit more on top of this garland kit you can add these beautiful stars it looks amazing so you saw how this garland looks on its own and then i'm am showing you what you can do what else you can do with this balloon garland i love it so pretty this is it you guys this is my review of bloomsies balloon garland kit let me know what you think if you have any additional questions, please leave everything in the comment section below. I'll be there. I will answer every single comment. I will try to help you out to the best of my abilities. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Share it with family and friends. That's always helpful. If you're new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below for more videos. I hope you'll have a wonderful day and I will see you back very soon. Bye!